Are you sure he's going to approve our marriage? I mean, did he tell me that he was a traditional man? It's the 21st century, honey. I'm sure he will understand. Daddy, there is something we want to tell you. Come sit down. What do you want to tell me? Daddy, Peter and I are getting married. What? I don't approve. Daddy! Daddy! Everyone seems to know what happens during a heart attack in a movie or TV show. Unfortunately, that doesn't always happen in real life. The signs and symptoms accompanying heart attack can be subtle, and many people brush it off without seeking medical help. Do you know the signs and symptoms accompanying heart attack? The symptoms of a heart attack are not always sudden or severe. They can vary from person to person. Some people may not even get chest pain at all. Instead, they may get pain or discomfort in the upper parts of the body. Not all male heart attack sufferers will experience the signs below, but it is important to know the common ones such as prolonged crushing or squeezing pain in the center of the chest, pain or discomfort in other areas such as the jaw, neck, arm or back, shortness of breath, dizziness, nausea or breaking out in a cold sweat. The symptoms that a female experiences in a heart attack may be different from what a man gets, such as unusual fatigue, nausea or abdominal discomfort that may feel like indigestion, dizziness or lightheadedness, Discomfort, described as pressure, tightness, or an ache in the neck, shoulder, or upper back. In the weeks before an actual heart attack, some women may get these signs as a warning that the artery is blocked. If you do experience any of these symptoms, do contact your doctor and treat this as a medical emergency. In some cases, in a heart attack, the heart may go into brief spasms before stopping entirely. This is known as a cardiac arrest and it is a medical emergency. Signs and symptoms suggesting a person has gone into cardiac arrest include unconsciousness, not breathing, no response to any stimulation such as being touched or spoken to. If you think somebody has gone into cardiac arrest, please call for an ambulance immediately. If you are a trained first aider, look for a piece of equipment called an automated external defibrillator, also known as an AED, or perform chest compressions if you are not able to find an AED nearby. If you experience any of these signs, do call for an ambulance. Remember, in a medical emergency, every second counts. <laughs>